Good morning, Dylan. Uh, I am pulling out of the Martin Luther King Jr. Recreation Center. There is the intersection of Route 9 and Main Street Whitesboro. And I'm headed west on Main Street and Whitesboro. And we're going to, uh, some of this will be a little bit familiar, maybe. <laughs> um, here is the bike path looking north goes all the way up to the zoo and looking south which is intended to connect all the way down to Cape May um, this is back to um, Main Street and the houses along here which we showed you the other day still some standing water around here drainage is very much an issue uh, all throughout Cape May County uh, especially in this area there's the house we showed you um, the other day. Just gonna give you an orientation, and I've turned left onto Hobbs Street. So you can see the houses that are along here. There is a mixture of homes uh, in terms of sizes, ages, uh, maintenance levels. Uh, there's definitely signs of investment going on here, which is a good sign. Uh, that's a pretty significant remodel going on there. And then across the street, you have a very small, um, older house, but it appears to be fairly well maintained. Mildew on that siding there. Uh, this is, again, this is a damp uh, area around the county, but in particular this area, not back, there's some underdeveloped, or undeveloped property here which is um, probably an indication that there's water uh, concentrated on that property. But all behind these houses are, is this woods, it looks like. Don't know how far that goes back as you head over towards Route 9, but uh, there's a lot of woods around here. We're coming up on the house you've got the offer on here. A little side street goes back to that house. Uh, this would be your next door neighbor here. And then there's the house you've made the offer on. Uh, I would tell you that uh, this is easily the nicest house in this immediate area. Um, it's across the street. Then there's a little cross street here, Scott. Sorry, I don't have my cameraman with me this morning, so this video quality is probably not going to be wonderful. But uh, again, looking now at the side of the house you got the offer on and decent sized yard all cleared and then it's very wooded in the back which is uh, creates a buffer um, and that goes all the way back here and then this side street dead ends here and you've got these houses here but again this is all wooded back here and I'm gonna turn around right quickly looking back through the woods back towards the house you've got the offer on and up high like that is a really good thing. I don't know what you've got under that house in terms of how much basement. There's obviously at least a crawl space, which is good. Um, maybe some moisture, but the fact that it's up high uh, means you've got a relatively minor problem, if a problem at all. Um, and uh, certainly bodes well for the water that does uh, tend to hang here. So there you go. Uh, for what it's worth, I feel a lot better about that property on your behalf than I did the other one that even though it's just right up here that just feels better uh, in uh, in several respects but uh, I know this is an exciting development for you keep me posted let me know if there's anything else I can do to help you have a great day